I'm uh, Alan and I'm chairman of Ring Mobility Hall. I've been chairman now for 25 years. I worked it out, I think it was um, last week. We have 45 different activities happening over that week and there have been about 700 people been using the Village Hall in that time. I run my own business called Little Learners. It's, it's a messy play business for children. The hall's a perfect space to use. It's quite a reasonable price so it means I can still make money with my business but people can still take part. It's great. The age range is quite amazing because uh, the youngsters who are in the, in the Simmons Hall this afternoon and then once we've cleared them out and tidied up after them we've got this birthday party for a lady who's lived in the village for many years and she's a hundred. So we're going from tiddler right up to seniors in one day. People use it, people enjoy using it, people connect with each other, I think it's fantastic. I first moved to the village eight years ago with a one-year-old. The first thing I did when I moved here was come to a toddler group based at this village hall. And that's really where my very first friendships in the community began. Yeah, no one tells you before you become a parent how difficult it is. And it's really difficult to get out of the house. It can be isolating and it can be lonely, so it's really important to have the space to connect. Loneliness in rural areas, I think, is quite hidden. Small communities, can become very isolated and unless you've got a supportive community around you or family you are then being quite constrained and caught in that. Village halls can definitely help with loneliness. Across the generations it's an important space for people. I think villages should have two village halls 